perhaps the most important part right now is Shiba Inu. Near, nearly half of Shiba Inu holders facing losses. What's next for SHIB? By the way, uh, I got a new AI generated uh, software. The pictures and the images that I'm trying to do right here, that's what we're going to, uh, that's where we try to be using this a little bit more going forward um, and have a little bit of fun with it. But nearly half of SHIB holders are in uh, losses. So the price trend for SHIB has been disappointing over the last several weeks. This decline has affected investor sentiment as evidenced by the narrow gap between the number of holders who are in the money and those out of the money. Now, uh, SHIB has experienced a steady decline and is looking very, very oversold right now. Uh, so the short-term moving average fluctuated between acting as support and resisted. It's now solidified its role as resist and has remained in this position for several weeks. So that means that you are in a situation where you have a buying opportunity, right? Uh, when you see the RSI start to get low, when you start to see all of these things happening, then that's when you're wanting you're going to want to get in, right? So the RSI is slightly below 30, suggesting that the asset is oversold. Uh, being in such a state could signal a big buying opportunity. So uh, what does that mean? Well, it means that the SHIB uh, price is poised for a massive rally because it has entered a buy zone. In recent weeks, crypto analyst SHIB Knight highlighted insights by attaching a chart displaying major price levels for SHIB. The analysis suggests that SHIB has entered a new buy zone, signaling an attractive opportunity for investors. That opportunity is around 1800 uh, with a an emergency buy setting at around 401760. Well, guess what? That's exactly where we are right now. So if that is the case, and that, that is the case, uh, allegedly, then we've entered the buy zone for another reversal on SHIB. Now, uh, when you look at SHIB on the one hour chart, you're going to see an RSI of about 46. RSI of 46 is not a buy zone. So uh, no matter what anybody tells you, that's not a buy zone. And uh, it's also 46 on the four hour. On the daily, it's down to 30 though. That's what really, really matters. The shorter time frames, not so important. Now, if you were to look at the chart for SHIB right now, then what you see is you, you've got this opportunity for a bounce coming up. Now, what I would say is most likely uh, you've we've turned 200 MA into resistance here. And by the way, this thing is breaking. This is the EMA. So uh, it's a little bit different than the SMA. However, uh, it, it is breaking down, 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 down towards it. So this is potentially where you get a, a significant bounce because you did not get it off of the 200 MA. So this other EMA uh, with a low RSI, this is all a signal that there should be a, a, a big impulse move coming very, very soon. And, you know, to be fair, like it looks like that's exactly what's happening. If I draw this out just a little bit more, I'm going to draw this again, this just a little bit more then what do you see happening here? What you see is we, we went down this channel and I'm going to move this out of the way as well and we'll get rid of that. Uh, but what you're seeing is that the uh, we had the breakout above the line and after breaking out, we came straight back down for a back test again on that channel. And right now we're meandering along it but we need a breakout. That significant breakout should go up above the 50 S uh, moving average. If it does, then it's going to be a bullish indicator of upside momentum. So that means that we're going to have to get back in that 22, 24 range for a breakout. And that's what's going on with SHIB right now. So uh, if you uh, are, are not following it, you're not paying attention to it, then uh, pay attention because there might be a significant rally coming up pretty soon. Natural market makers most probably like the project at this price right now, and will probably be making some moves into it. So, uh, and by the way, whales continue to accumulate. Cryptonomy.finance just had an update. They are now available in four different languages. In active development are a lot of cool different updates and information about partnerships from Cryptonomy that's going to be announced very, very soon. Now, to be part of that, follow them on Telegram at Cryptonomy underscore finance and on Twitter at Cryptonomy underscore Phi. Now, what's going on with Cryptonomy.finance is nothing short of incredible. My positions on this launch pad have been just outstanding. And my contract ends November 21 of 2024. And at this point, I think that that's not even going to be the max of the bull run. So if you will give me just a moment here, I'm going in. By the way, I've done very well on Cryptonomy. I'm going to go with the silver level contract and end right here 19 june 2025 we're gonna go three bitcoin on this move all right so we've got a bronze that's been 
just absolutely killing the game, guys. I put in half a Bitcoin uh, previously. If you remember, that was $30,000 Bitcoin at that point. So, you know, we put in about $15,000. My crude interest so far, and by the way, I do have, this is a share because it's a 50-50 split, but my cut of that $84,241 right now in Bitcoin. So this is an incredible rate of return so far for Cryptonomy.finance. So uh, do you want to be part of that? Sign up to Cryptonomy.finance today.